I'm going to show you what I got in this little bag here. You might have an idea from the shiny apple on it. Uh, now, as we record this, uh, 11, 12, 13, mm. November 12th, 2013, um, this morning at midnight Cupertino time, 3 a.m. East Coast time, Apple eh, just took the store down and put the iPad mini with retina display on the store. So um, at midnight Cupertino time, 3 a.m. East Coast time, Apple just closed the store, the uh, online store, and said, uh, uh, we got the iPad mini with retina. They had said not available till the end of November, and uh, and here it is. Now, I ordered it immediately when I woke up this morning, and it said, oh, you'll get it uh, maybe November 19th or 20th. Oh, rats, I would really love to have it today, a week earlier for before you buy. Well, by this afternoon, in the middle of Mac Break Weekly, I noticed that the Apple Store was allowing pickup. And this is what we're hearing. Somebody from Best Buy emailed me last night saying, I've got one in my hands. Apparently... Apple has told all of its retailers, as soon as you get them, you can sell them. And uh, as soon as the Apple store gets some in stock, then you can buy for in-store pickup. So we did. I, uh, I was in the middle of Mac Break Weekly, but fortunately, uh, Glenn Rubenstein and uh, Josh Windish were available to take this trip down. Now they get in the car. <laughs> Chad, can we go right now and pick one up? Really? All right, Glenn's off to get our mini. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, look, oh. look, there, oh, there, I see it. somebody. All right. <laughs> All right, they've wrested just... it away from Josh. And right. here it is, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, hey. Wow, that was a mission, wasn't it? Well, you may wonder why Robert was sitting in the street with a chicken. No reason. Uh, it's Petaluma, yeah. basically. That's why. Uh, he was waiting for Balut. Uh, yep. No, what happened was uh, we wanted to make sure that uh, Glenn and Josh could get it in here in time, and so we were saving a parking space, right, for him. <laughs> and uh, that worked out well. Nobody ran you over. It's in the sun. It was beautiful. It was Thank nice you. Out. Yeah. Did you order a pizza? I did. They would not <laughs> deliver to a parking spot. You're kidding. No, that's strange. They hung up on you? They hung up on me. I what did just, you say? I said, look for the guy in the red jacket holding a, a chicken. And they're like, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, uh, yeah. They probably get a lot of calls they probably for the do. Yeah, it's Killer Street. Yeah. yeah. So here it is. And actually, but in, in addition to the, uh, the uh, so the iPad mini is $399 for the basic 16 gig Wi-Fi. I ended up getting the 64 gig uh, Wi-Fi model. No engraving or I wouldn't have gotten it today. Uh, I also decided, well, I'm going to get the smart case. I'm not a fan of the um, smart cover. It keeps it falling off. But the smart case actually goes all the way around the iPad mini. And this is the product red version. The negative on this one, and the do not buy really on this one, is it's uh, very expensive, 60 bucks uh, for, it's leather. It's leather. Well, leather or pleather? No, no. It smells like dead cow. It's leather. <laughs> now, they say it's actually leather. It's uh, specially treated. But here it is. Should we open it up now? I'll be, uh, I'll be uh, completely honest because we wanted to show this in action. Mm -hmm. I have opened this uh, prior to the show. And I, uh, there we go. And I set it up so that we would have something to show. Otherwise, I'd have to go through the uh, Apple setup. But let me just show you. This is an iPad uh, Air. Uh, same exact styling as the iPad Air. But size-wise, of course, it's 7.9 inches instead of 9.7 inches. The screen is smaller. But in almost every respect, this is a duplicate of the iPad Air. Same A7 processor. Uh, same external uh, M7 uh, processor watching uh, the uh, accelerometer and so forth. The screen resolution is even the same. In fact, when you get the screen resolution on a smaller screen, the dots per inch is higher on this. There is one difference. Uh, as this has come out, people have been benchmarking it with Geekbench, uh, and it's been reported by Mac Rumors. Jason Snell's reported this also, that it is slightly slower clock speed. This is about 1.3 gigahertz instead of the 1.4 gigahertz in the iPad Air. Same speed, same processor, same speed as on the iPhone S. I don't think you're going to notice much difference. That's Really not a huge difference from the point of view of uh, of a u of a normal user. Let's unlock it, and I'll tell you what, uh, Padre. I'm going to give you the honors of telling me what you think of the Retina display. This is the iPad Mini. I'm a fan of the Mini, by the way. I got to tell you, I loved the the la the original Mini, with one exception. I said, why didn't they do a Retina display on the Mini? I mean, it just it just begs to have a Retina. So I was very gratified that uh, Apple uh, allowed us no photos for you. Well, let me take a picture real quickly. <laughs> Oh, it's it's downloading them from my photo stream, so that, so there'll be a few pictures. In fact, 
Is that the picture uh, I took of Sarah oh, Lane? No. I did. <laughs> <laughs> she so <doesn't> like that, <laughs> she's not. She's not happy now. I'll tell you. Uh, so, um, you know, I I really wanted something that I could hold in one hand that it would have that small form factor. It's of course lighter, not much lighter, because the new air is so much lighter, but uh, still under uh, the air, under a pound. Um, and I, I don't know. Look at the screen, Robert. You tell me. Uh, what do you think of the? Uh, of this display on this. We're oh, gonna... man. I, I mean, look, the the Retina display was the one thing that, that Mac Mini, uh, that iPad Mini users have been wanting yes. since it was released. Yes. And Apple is just a master of that. You know, they, they hold one feature back. People really want it. They build up anticipation, and then, boom, they release it. Mm -hmm. It does look good. I mean, yeah. I, I, once you've seen a Retina, it's hard going back. I agree. And that's, uh, you know, I've been using my Mini... As my go-to uh, iPad, it's the one I brought on vacation with me and everything. But I'm very happy that they have basically given the iPad Mini parity with the right. Big Brother uh, in terms of roughly in terms of speed, certainly in terms of processor. It's a 64-bit processor, and in terms of screen. Let's uh, let's just launch Infinity Blade and just enjoy the uh, Unreal Engine and uh, Retina Retina quality. And by the way, there is the uh, there's the smart case, and you see it's smart. It's just put it to sleep, and now it's going to wake it up again. Let me unlock this here real quickly. <laughs> <laughs> and that we can play Unreal. So uh, this is just a first look. I'll tell you what, I'll play with it next week. I'll give you my full review. Um, it's. I can only say this. I've been waiting for you a long time, baby. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks for showing up. And we've crashed. Oh. There we go. <laughs> There's room for improvement. There's That's always completely room normal. For improvement. Completely normal. The first time you run any, pro any big program. There you go. That's the iPad Mini. Now available with Retina Display. I almost can promise you these will be in very short supply before Christmas. Because a lot of people want them. But also, I understand the Retina Display is difficult to do. And so, if you're app you're lucky enough to have one at your Apple store, uh, or you can order one online, I would do so quickly. I wouldn't delay. I imagine we'll see uh, long waits uh, soon for the Retina. So look at how this matches us. <laughs> it's stealth. It's, you can almost, it's, it's almost <laughs> like I don't have an iPad.